hey, can I eat beer? Yeah, that's German for hey, can I get a beer? And if I go to Germany, well, that's all I'll need to know. I guess the beer wasn't German. Ah, I still gotta be myself. Hey YouTube, welcome to the most amazing top five. My name's Michael McCredden, sit back, subscribe, and let me entertain you. First off, I wanna hear from you guys. What country do you wanna see a top five list on in the future? Let me know in the comments down below. Okay, let's jump into our list with the top five strange facts about Germany. First off, in the number five spot, they got the world's longest word. Now this word, it referred to a law delegating beef labels, but even the Germans themselves were like, we gotta get rid of this thing, and they did. But they still got some doozies. They're there's this one, Koppen, Hooken, Doggen, Dugen. I don't know, it has something to do about automobile insurance. And then there's Dono Dugan Dubba Do. That has something to do about the widow of a steamboat captain. Moving on to the number four spot, the government, they will pay for sex for disabled people. All of a sudden, I'm gonna go there with a the problem. In Germany, a stipend covers the cost of people with disabilities to pay for intercourse. So not only is prostitution legal, but it's also part of your welfare check. There's even certified sexual experts to make sure you're getting the best bang for your buck. Literally. To me, it sounds like retirement homes in good old Deutschland is where you die and go to heaven. I guess you don't die, but they might kill you with all that sex. Moving on to the number three spot, the Chancellor of Germany. The woman's got her own Barbie doll. For Mattel's 50th anniversary, the company came out with a model of Germany's Chancellor, Angela Merkel, sporting the same practical haircut, a power suit, and proportions similar to that of her own. Now, she is a bit of a babe, so I don't, I don't blame her for doing this. Moving on to the number two spot, the government in Germany, well, they will accept or reject your choice in baby name. According to German law, a person's gender must be obvious by first name. So kiss names like Bailey, Jaden, and Taylor, goodbye. This is why names like Michael and Maria are a huge hit out in Germany. I'd fit in just fine. Finally, in the number one spot, university, it is free to everyone, even non-Germans. Lower Saxony was the final state to scrap public university tuition. Now getting a degree is free for nationals and non-nationals alike, which is absolutely ludicrous to me. I mean, I paid $50,000 here in Canada and I still never got a job. Thank you, YouTube. All right, guys, that's all I got for you in this video. My name is Michael Crud. Thanks for checking out Most Amazing Top 5. Be sure to check out our other videos. I've talked about France. I've talked about America. I've talked about Canada. I've talked about Australia. Let me know what country you want me to talk about next in the comments down below. Also, what other Top 5s do you want to see? Hit subscribe. I'll see you guys in the next one.